Well, we're off out again. Hang on a minute. Happy holidays, people. Happy, Happy bloody holidays. Happy bloody holidays. So we are off again to Warwick Racecourse, but this time there's a meet for the first part of our little little holiday. Yeah, I've just put £500 for diesel in again. How much have you actually put in? £88. £88. £88 quid? Yeah. That's before I get there. But we are going to the, the racecourse for two days and then up Leic Somewhere else. Leicestershire way, I think it is, for a, a couple of days as well. So we'll have a little bet on the races when we get there. And he's remembered the lasagna that I've cooked today, fresh. I did have to remind him that it was still in the truck when we jumped into this. I can't think of everything, people. I know, I know these women expect us men to, you know, to uh, think one of thing, everything, but one thing that's we just can't do. It's impossible. We know we're 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 super super beans, but it's not going to happen, is it? One thing that's all you had to remember, and the other one was in the, the lasagna from last week was in a beautiful lasagna proper dolmio dish that I've had for years, and he threw the lot. Didn't even bother to get it out, clean it out, nothing. Just skip the lot. Unbloody believable. Oh well, not happy with that. You're looking very pretty today. Shut up, Robert. <laughs> You're gonna yeah. have a laugh, people. You're gonna have a laugh. What it's all about having a laugh. I don't know you how. You can't whack it. I don't know how everyone's getting on with the app, but we're booked onto Warwick Racecourse. Booked it months ago because there's a meet on tomorrow. So we're in in the bus. Thought I'll just check the booking. No booking confirmed. So I've had to phone the racecourse up, and she said, "Yes, you are booked," but on the app it's saying we haven't got anything booked. So they need to sort this out. I know it's very new, but come on. Yeah. Oh, unbelievable, unbloody believable. Hope but we're you enjoyed okay. our live the other night, people. You were what? you were quite well behaved, actually. I thought it was pretty good, to be honest. So uh, you know, if you miss it, if you want to go back and have a look, happy with us, happy. Yeah. So uh, we'll crack on. Yeah. Got the tortoise with us and the dogs because we're away for more than two days. So the world's most travelled tortoise, Herman, is back with us again. Yeah, this has been an absolutely stunning, beautiful day. It has. The sun's out, it's, oh, saying 14 degrees, but it feels a lot warmer than that. It says 13 degrees on my watch, but it's the sun's out, blue skies, beautiful. Just like me. Shut up, Robert. Oh, we just put that on then and we didn't see the speed hump. So we were here not that long ago, were we? Have I been here before then? Yes, Robert, of course you have beautiful church in front. And the phone's going mad because Lynn's just put something on Instagram. Down Fryer Street. And the dogs obviously know that we're nearly here for some reason. I do not know, ever, can't understand how they can know that we're here. And there it is in front, and I bet it's going to be a lot busier than it was last time we came. And it will be tomorrow because it's race day and he's actually going to let me have a bet. Only a couple of pound. Well, there's about seven races. Turn so we'll see who can pick the pick the best nag. <laughs> well, I've got the best nag in here. Well, I wouldn't be a nag if you did things right the first time, would it? And the dogs are going mental. They look, well, they do now, don't they? They do. Right. Whack it round here. Turn the sat nav off. And this is why you have to come the day before the race because they close this off, obviously, because you have to drive across the race course because it's set in the middle. Yes. You're looking very really pretty, my little angel. Oh, shut up, Robert. Let's go and check in. Unbelievable. Well, we're all set up, people. We've took the dogs out for a walk. Excited about tomorrow? The I'm races? Going to win. It'll Hang on, she's I'll piping up. Hang on. I'll be the winner. What did you say, my little angel? I said, I will be the winner. There's two horses on the first race. Girl of my dreams, which you should have. Or... I haven't met her yet. <laughs> or No No Tonic. No No Tonic? Yeah. That's a cert. We'll put the apes on that. It's got to be doing something to do with gin, hasn't it? Yeah, can I just give all you fellow motorhomers, caravanners, a tip? I always prepare food before we set off. Of course he does. Because when you get here and you're all knackered, you've got a lovely meal.
to tuck into. That's if you remember to bring it. Unbelievable. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. It's race day. We're sitting here. Right in picking our, our winners. Yes. And who's going to be the winner? Me. The bookie. Well, let's face it, you're a winner the day you met me. <laughs> Unbelievable. So, yeah, we're going to pick the... We haven't got a clue what to do. No, we're not We're not gamblers, to be honest. But I took a gamble on her when I got married. Best, best bet you ever took. I wouldn't go that far. So, yeah, we're picking our runners and riders, and then we're going to see how... If we have to pay to go over or... What we're well, if we've got to pay to go over, that's out. No, it's not. It's race day, and we're going to have a treat. Give us a kiss. No. Okay. <laughs> Before we crack on with our day, people, I'd like to show you something. Yes, absolutely something that we are over the moon with. And it's not me. Mm, definitely not. And it, we actually, we've, we've paid the lady for this. We asked her to do it for us, and we've paid her. And it's absolutely stunning. So thank you, Julie, from Cheeky Monkey Crochet. Happy with that, Julie? Very thank happy. Thank you so much. It's amazing. Yeah. You're amazing. Yeah, massive thank you from both of us. Check that out. Absolutely brilliant. Robin in on tour. Happy holidays. And a picture of the bus. Brilliant. <sighs> I was just thinking. What? Did it we... hurt? <sighs> Unbelievable. We could be on TV soon. No. Although there are lots of cameras here. Happy with that. There we go. You never know. So, the reason we're going off walking isn't just to take the dogs. It's because Robert's tight. So, to avoid him paying £20 each for us to get into the races, we're going for a walk to find a bookies, to place the bets, so we haven't got to go inside, so he can just drink his gin and tonic near the van. Well, to be honest, that makes sense to me because we're actually right on the race course, so why pay £20 each to get in the place when you can walk up the road, put your bets on, go back, chill out, job done. And it was my idea. Happy with that. Yeah, looking very pretty today. Shut up, Robert. Why are, we, why are we here in Warwick? Yeah. Do you want a romantic meal? Really? Yeah. This morning. Well, do you want a romantic yes. early meal? Yes. There you go. Chip shop. Yeah. We get a bag of chips to share? No, thank you. Unbelievable. Ungrateful. Yes, yeah, so it's uh, getting busy now on race day. People piling in, piling in all the time. Where we walk the dogs over there, which you can do no problem any day of the week, as long as it's not race day, because they use it as a car park. I opened the blinds this morning. There was this huge lorry. I was hoping it was a mobile calf. It really wasn't. A mobile calf? Yeah, that's it down there, look. Let's go and have a oh, we can't, can we? Because we've got the dogs. What, just walk past this? Let's go and have a look, eh? Yeah. Yeah, so that's the uh, lorry the uh, my little princess was on about. It's a uh, screen so you can watch it live. That's what you call a pop-up TV. <laughs> can I just make this point, people, in saying we, uh, we don't, we're not promoting gambling in any way, no. shape or form. It's just a bit of fun for us, something different. We've spent £28 on seven races, £2 each per, per yeah, race. Because everybody knows it's just a bloody mugs game. But, but you know, a bit of fun. bit of fun for us. Happy with that. I love that pop-up TV. Can I have one that big? Just kidding. No. I'll have one anyway. So we're in the perfect place. We are parked there and the racetrack is just there. So what we'll do, we'll stand just down there later and watch the horses. Brilliant, looking forward to it. Uh, while I've got the opportunity, can I just mention the magnets that I uh, stuck on using the uh, Sikaflex uh, on the last vlog? Was it the last vlog? I think it was. Anyway, they've stuck absolutely solid. And they've also, oh, I don't know if I mentioned this, but they've got a spring there to stop them, uh, uh, you know, damaging the van. So let's have a look to see how we get on. There we go, because last time it opened up to there, and now, perfect. You don't get much better than that, people. Now I can get in there. And still smack his head when he's try trying to get in and No out. problem at all. Well, you do have a problem, because you're a bit on the big side, aren't you? Unbelievable. There you go. <sighs> Dead chuffed with that. Dead chuffed. Right people, we've just popped back for a cup of coffee because the first race isn't until 25 to 2. 
So we come back for a, a bit of a refreshment. Oh, look, you're really Shut up, Robbers. <laughs> a nice cup of coffee. Before we start winning our money back. 28 well, quid. Well, one of the races, there's only three races, three horses running. So if we don't yeah. win on that race, either of us, then... Yeah, what we should have done is had better than all of them. No. That's not really the way to go, is it? Anyway, so while we're waiting, we, we just want to wish uh, Janice uh, a speedy recovery. She had a bit of an accident. She's in France at the moment with Brad and uh, she fell off a push bike and smashed all her face up. Yeah, she's got a black eye, as you can see from this photo. Wrong way. <laughs> yeah, so... Yeah, uh, please just get better soon, Jan. I hope you're feeling a bit more, a bit better today now. Yeah, yeah. and uh, we, you know, it could have been a lot worse, so we yeah. wish you all the best. It could have been me. Don't be silly, you're not tall enough to get on a bike. Right, I've got me lucky hat on. I've got my ticket. First race coming up. Let's go. And then you've got people here, all the chairs, to watch the race from the campsite. Perfect. First one's off. Are you an excited little angel? I am. This is, I'll tell you, this is one of the best camping things we've done absolutely loving it it's a bit different it's a, it's just brilliant so i would recommend you to come to a race course on a race day but you have to come the day before obviously because you can't ride across the track have you finished it yeah happy with that happy so have you got in your first race spitfire girl and i've got no tonic no no tonic mine's gonna win are you feeling lucky i am two pound on i've got to win I don't know what the odds are. Hey, hang on, if it wins... It's my money. No, it's my money. No, it's not. I put it on. No, it's my money. Domestic again at the race. Definitely racetrack. my money if I win. Definitely yeah. another domestic at the race. Yeah. Here they come. Okay, that's what the screen's for. So when they go past you, you can see it on the big screens. Brilliant. Or not, that one with the nose band on is mine and it's winning. Happy about that. Where's yours? Last at the moment. I think it's still in the stands, isn't it? In yeah. the stands? Yours has still, yours has still got the one with the straw hat. Mine has lost a shoe. Unbelievable. We've just come back in the bus after the first race. You know, my lucky hat, don't you? Pot of crap. <laughs> Yeah, my ticket. Bloody hell. Got it. But I can honestly say this is Brilliant. amazing. We highly recommend this. Absolutely. We don't want to keep love it. banging on about it, but it's amazing. You need to come to the races. It's brilliant. In the motorhome, grab a drink, which we're going to do now. Go and watch the second race. Happy, happy days. And we'll let you know after if we win at all. Give us a kiss. No. If you'd have won, you give me a kiss. Hang on. If, if, if I get a, a winner, she's going to give me a kiss on film. On the cheek. No, tongue job. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> let's go. Come it's on. race two. Yeah, I don't know who I've got. Where's Come on, tickets? let's crack on. Quick, get your tickets. <sighs> this is it. This could be it. A winner. No word. That's mine. No word. And mine is business touch. Come on, then. Let's go. Yeah, we don't want to bang on about it, people, but it's a fantastic day. No, it would be, but the next race, my horse isn't even bloody running anymore. Unbelievable. First, the first horse I backed lost a shoe, so came last. And now the second one I backed isn't even running. What's your middle name? Jonah? Yeah, for the last 33 years. <laughs> Hang on, the cameras are up there, sort of waving quick. Here we go, race two, and I'm in front. Gutted. Well, your horse led again, didn't it? Run like a bloody donkey. At the end. Unbelievable. And mine's a non-runner, so I think you can take you can take it back. I'm not 100% sure, but if we get a win, then... So, I don't think betting's our game, is it? It's still a good day, though. It's brilliant. Right. What time's the next one? Half an hour. Half an hour? We're back on the track. Yeah, let's see if I can pick another donkey. 
race free. That's Lynn's horse there. It's warming up. And there's your horse at the back again. Yeah, that's my that's mine there. Look, he's looking pretty fit to be honest. But then again, I do wake up to you every morning. What are you on about? Well, they're looking fit. Shut up! I've took me lucky hat off because that's a complete waste of time. Yeah, you can. There's one word for us: losers. There, there was a horse that I think Robert should have backed, and that's lost in the mist. Because <laughs> that's that, that's probably where his old nag is at the moment. But there's only three horses in this race. Yeah. And it's a fa I keep banging on, it's a fantastic day. The, the sun's shining, it, it's just brilliant, isn't it? Really, really Bloody brilliant hell. day. Am I going to snog tonight, people? No, you won't. I'll be too knackered from running backwards and forwards from the motorhome. Who's the keys? No. Oh. No, you're a loser. Loser! <laughs> Unbelievable. And have a guess who this one is. Yeah. What? You couldn't pick your nose. <laughs> or do you want to go first? Or shall I? I think you did come second, but there was only exactly. three horses. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and I came third. We're not having much luck at all, people. No. Mind you, it wouldn't have mattered if we'd have won because of the odds on favour. We've only put two pound on them. Yes. No, mine was 28 to 1. At least I'd have been a winner. Yeah, you can see why it was 28 to 1. It run like a bloody donkey. Not doing very well. Oh, well, I've always got the next one to look forward to, which is on at, uh, can't see, 20 past. 20 past, half an hour. 20 past. They're every half an hour, aren't they? Yeah. So it gives us just have time to have a quick drink, drown our sorrows. I think I bloody need one, the money you keep chucking away. Oh, it's only two pounds at a time. Do you think if you'd have put ten, twenty pound on? But I wouldn't have done, would I? Yeah, you would if it wasn't for me. No, I would not. Mm. Happy. Give us that kiss. No. Camera's very low. Don't be like that. Hello. Hey. <laughs> well, my little angel, how did you get on? I came second. Who came first? The favourite that he backed. And it's no, not even worth walking up the town to go and pick his winnings up. <laughs> but at least I won. I'm happy about that, people. Happy. Yeah, but my, mine, if mine had a won, we'd have picked up some, some money. Because I'd pick the, don pick the donkeys. But it came second out of six. So, all is good. I'm beating Lynn, which I'm happy about. Yeah. He's the winner. I'm a loser. Well, we hope you've uh, enjoyed our day at the races, people, because we certainly have. It's been brilliant. I can't recommend this day enough. Absolutely great. So, shall we just see now who's the winner and who is the loser? How many of you won today, Robert? How many has Lynn won today? Three! And a non-runner, so I get my £2 back on that one. And I have got three first places. Happy with that. <laughs> yeah, so we've worked it out. We've we've put twenty eight pound on the on the horses, and uh, we've probably won what? I don't know. We I, I about don't fifteen quid. Something I don't like. know how it works. Mine's yeah. just come in mm. at five to two, so that's ten twelve pound back. Mm. So I don't yeah, know. But it's not about the money. It's all about a good day out, and it's been brilliant. And we'll definitely be doing it again. Yes, one hundred percent. Yeah. Best day of camping, I think, and I've enjoyed. It's been amazing. Happy with that, Pigeon? Happy. And because I'm a winner and he's a loser. Oh, he's not going on about yeah, it, is that? You did lose, didn't you? Unbelievable, isn't it? You couldn't it? pick your own nose, could you? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so uh, thanks so much for watching. If you do come across our channel, people, people. Please subscribe, drop us a comment, and give us a like. So. Yeah, until, well, we're going up to Leicestershire tomorrow, so we're going to hopefully film what we're up to up there. Yeah. Happy about that. Looking forward to that. Yeah. So uh, stay safe, fellow caravan, as motor members, tent is drift subscribers are new. We still love you. We do. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one. In a bit. Mm -hmm.